Hey guys, it is Shadow Guard, and I have a quick presenting video for you. Uh, slash channel promotion, I guess. Um, this is a gun I got off of my friend. You, some of you have watched my videos a lot, may know him as Xops. And this is really cool. This is a modded Fire Strike, and it's basically been turned into a slug gun. I have, uh, just for reference, real quick, I have my shadow strike that I modded right here just for a little bit of comparison that's still that is still made to shoot nerf darts this is made purely for slugs you can see right here this slides open I'm not super familiar with the terms for these internals and slug and homemade guns in general I'm kinda just getting into it so I really don't know that much so I'm not really gonna use a lot of terminology because I don't want to sound like an idiot he also gave me about a hundred slug rounds, which these are very nice. I don't know what type of BB he used. I think it's a 9mm BB, but I'm not really sure. Uh, very nice slug rounds, so let's just go ahead and shoot this. Most of what I know is that basically he went and gutted the internals, went and put this PVC breech in, which is very nice. And then um, put a K25 spring in the back and added a, the keyring mod. And that's basically all I know about this gun. And basically what you do to load it is you take this, slide this forward until it, it's open, take a slug, set it inside here, let me zoom in. And then you take the slug and push it as hard as you can into this thing. Once it's pushed in there a lot, slide this back take and prime this which is gonna be murder on my fingers if I want to use this for a, any nerf wars and go ahead and shoot this thing gets amazing range I'm I'm thinking like 80 feet minimum and really with slug and homemade guns in general you're gonna get those type of ranges you know that's just the quality that these guns are which is one reason why I want to get into them I'm just going to go ahead and shoot one more of these slug rounds as I end this video. And I just want to talk a little bit more about the gun itself. It's got a pretty nice paint job. Um, I think he used some vinyl gloss on it to give it an extra like shine. He the way most of the way his painting styles he's doing now is where he basically doesn't paint anything that's orange just for safety reasons and because some of the orange things can be kind of tricky to paint. So, um, as far as I go, I love this thing. I mean, this is going to be awesome to use in, like, you know, for long range or pistol wars or something like that. Um, I really enjoy it. I really am appreciative of it. This is actually a birthday present. I might have already mentioned that. I don't know. But, um, so yeah, Xops 17s, Fire Strike, Slug Mod. I guess I'm going to call, I guess I'm going to call this the Slug Strike because. I can't think of any unique names right now. So I'm going to shoot this and end this video. Please check out his channel. I will put a link to his channel in the description below so you guys can check it out. He doesn't have a bunch of videos uploaded, but what he does have is pretty cool. He's far more knowledgeable about homemades than I am. And, um, you know, just go at least watch his videos, and that's about it. So until next time... Thanks for watching.